We all know the PUBG guy is strong. I mean, he can continue to run at the brink of death, survive multiple shots to the head, and heal up using Red Bull. He is also apparently immune to drug overdose since he can take infinite amount of painkillers and adrenaline syringes with no consequences. But how strong is he? I will check his strength by measuring how much weight he can carry. We will assume that he has the level 3 kit which includes the level 3 backpack, the level 3 helmet and a level 3 armor to add the most weight. The PUBG guy can carry two main loaded weapons and a sidearm without using any space in the bag. He can also carry a melee weapon without using any space. Starting with the helmet, the level 3 helmet resembles the titanium K63 bulletproof helmet which weighs about 3.6 kilograms. The military vest resembles the improved outer tactical vest which weighs in at 14 kg. So the PUBG guy is already carrying 17.6 kg without any weapons. So now we have to figure out which is the heaviest weapon, sidearm and melee weapon. So let's start with the main weapon. Initially I thought it was going to be the arm or something which weighs in at about 6 kg. But my friend reminded me that M249 exists and M249 is really heavy at about 10 kg. I was satisfied with M249 being the heaviest weapon cause it also has 100 loaded ammo but I remembered something that will change everything. Payload mode. Payload mode has rocket launchers, grenade launchers, miniguns and tons of unique weapons. The M134 minigun is the heaviest weapon in the game weighing in at 19 kg unloaded. That along with its 200 ammo makes it the heaviest gun by far weighing in at 21.462 kg. Plus the PUBG guy can carry two of them at once making the weight he's carrying 42.924 kg and the total weight being 60.524 kg. The heaviest sidearm was a close match between M79 and the sword off. The sword off just edged out weighing in at 3.1 kilograms. Meanwhile the heaviest melee weapon is the pan weighing up to 3.6 kg. Now for the 450 back backpack space. I originally thought that arms ammo 300 magnum was the heaviest ammo and it actually is with 450 bullets weighing in at about 20 kg. But later I found out that energy drinks weighed even more and you can carry a lot of them too. 112 energy drinks weighed an incredible 28 kg which is much more than arm. I was satisfied with energy drinks being the winner but then I saw a reddit post where a guy had listed out all the items and the space it took. There was a comment that said, wow, I can't believe adrenaline syringe and jerry can take the same space. Then I realized, jerry can. The jerry can can carry 20 liters of fuel making one jerry can weigh equal to the weight of 20 liters of diesel plus 5.1 kg being the weight of the jerry can. This makes one jerry can weigh 21.74 kg which is more than arms ammo and you can carry 22 of them meaning your backpack can carry a whopping 478.28 kg of jerry cans. Along with the weight of the guns and armor the PUBG guy can carry an insane 545.504 kg and still run at full speed. This doesn't tell us how he's still alive after taking his own weight of adrenaline though. This may seem strong but this is nowhere near as close to the world record of the most weight lifted which is a whopping 2840 kg by Paul Anderson. The PUBG guy may be strong but he's far from the strongest. Maybe he should stick to drinking Red Bull on death's door. Hey you reached the end of the video. I would like to take this time to thank two of my viewers, Gameplays and 1K subs without any wits for their constant support. Thank you everyone for watching. I'd also like to give a special shout out to my friend A Flying Cat for helping me make this video. If you liked the video, please consider subscribing. Thank you.